it's actually a lot of pressure, but it's also really fun. So I don't know, it's a hard, it, it's a weird mix to feel like you're in such a high pressure environment while also loving what you do so much that you can't imagine doing anything else. We hear from a lot of readers that this is, would be their dream to try Best of Beauty products all the time. But it's like having ice cream. Your favorite food, but you have to eat it all the time at every single meal and you can never stop. And you have to do it for four months. Every morning, like we come in and it's like, we kind of share stories of like what everybody's tried and what worked, what didn't work. There's always some sort of occupational hazard for Best of Beauty. If something goes wrong every single year. It's very much trial and error. It'll start burning right here. I see all these small bumps all over my face. We had a couple of Best of Beauty related injuries with an eye cream that my son hit his older brother with. I'm really messy when it comes to testing self-tanner. I've gone through, I think, three comforters. So I started developing bumps and I went to the dermatologist and he said I developed some sort of eczema from trying and testing way too many products. I have ended up at the dermatologist quite a few times. <laughs> Even with those types of like injuries, uh, it's still worth it. This place is the best. I'm kind of taken aback by how many options there are. I think a lot of people need a little bit of guidance. You don't really know what the best is unless you try them all. So I just left work. Um, as you can see, I took a huge Best of Beauty bag home tonight. Doing a face mask. My boyfriend's also doing a face mask. I've learned to utilize every second of every day. I'm testing natural deodorant on a 90 degree day. Let's see how they do. You have to learn to give it time. This is day two of my very official curl cream testing process. This one seems to be holding up because my curls survived the night of being smushed and squished onto my pillows. And so now I'm just seeing how it works on the walk to the subway. Really, really pretty. We both have it on. Really nice. The only, this classic, one actually gets classic. the inside lip. It doesn't even, yeah, it's, like not, it's, it's not it's trying. It glides on. That's really and the cool. red is like a perfect red. It's really pretty. Not all products will work on all people. I think it makes you look cold. Yeah. I think it makes you look like a white walker. We really get in there and try the shades on everyone on staff, on different skin tones. I like this one better. More impact? More think? impact if you're going to wear red. Yeah. I like it on her. I like it on Crystal a lot. Oh, it smells like What's whiskey. <gasps> I like it already. Oh, it, it really gosh. does smell like whiskey. Kind of makes me like makes me hungover. <laughs> <laughs> it's really sexy. Mm, that is good. I would wear that in a heartbeat. Yeah. Okay, so I think we have good picks. Yay! Yay! So oh my god. What is that, a dark or is that a that's bright? A bright. I don't know that's a bright. 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 I think there's another category. I think there's bright, I think there's dark, and I think there's like, whoa. It reminds me of alcohol and bad decisions. <laughs> and that's a wrap. Sophie's. <laughs>